this is Darklord again with and the lots of fallen video in this video i'm going to show you how you can easily defeat adir which is the final boss of lots of fallen if you're following the good ending now the technique that i'm going to use is i would be using lumpy hammer to defeat this boss now that's a throwing stuff so basically if you are using it then you would need ammunition pouches as well uh, to defeat this boss the technique is once you enter into the arena you would see that Adir would uh, would be talking and he would keep on saying his stuff now there are many people around if you can see uh, like that there was one on my left side and there are uh, this one and there are some others now some of them have uh, the umber parasites attached to it uh, the first thing that you have to do is you have to as you run through the arena just make sure that you are scanning them and if there is some parasite just take them out because these people will take up the adir's message and they will turn into enemies and they will use the uh, probably adir's magic or something rune maybe uh, to uh, cast fire magic inferno magic against you like for example this one now the main thing is like i am going to throw these lumpy hammers at them to kill them off once you kill uh, these people adir will get damage now that's how we are going to do it the thing is like we can uh, do uh, some melee attacks but as you can see now once you defeat them they just burst open and once they start casting up the magic they even fire up the land beneath them so once you try to go near them uh, to hit them with uh, your weapon <laughs> you would get the fire damage as well so they will ignite you so just make sure that you are staying away and that's the easiest technique by the way which i found uh, to defeat this boss it's not a difficult boss at all i feel like this is somewhat copy of Renala from the Elden Rings where we had to uh, defeat these pupils in order to give damage to the Renala and once you break her down uh, and then uh, break her shell down then she comes down on the ground and you have to uh, give her damage well this is pretty much similar we are going to defeat these uh, people here and then once uh, you defeat them they burst up and that gives damage to a deer so as you can see these lumpy hammers they are quite powerful and they give a huge amount of damage of 700 something with one shot so usually i am able to take these uh, people down with a couple of hammer shots and i mean it's it's rather easy for me because like i can see like uh, their fire uh, balls coming up to me and then i can easily dodge I, i'm staying away from these people i'm not getting any fire damage from the ground which they fire up um, you can see which is underneath them so and the only thing is like you have to keep running here and there to find these people and the most important thing is like you have to make sure that you kill all of them uh, within specified time because once you are near the end then you would hear up a uh, beating of the heart i mean it would be pumping it starts pumping slowly and then it which will increase up uh, as, as you go near the uh, last stage of the boss and once you don't defeat uh, all of these uh, people here then that that heartbeat i mean then i don't know like there is some kind of magic which takes you up and you can't even skip that that takes you out in one shot i mean it doesn't give you any chance to stay so just make sure that you are defeating everyone within the specified time uh, you can see like i have taken up the fire damage now the reason is because these people they are throwing these fireballs at me i mean <laughs> just come on and if you if you saw that I, the charge attack with the lumpy hammer gave him like 1124 damage i mean it's huge it just took him off with the one shot but i would suggest you not to charge because uh everyone is throwing these fires uh fireballs at you you can see that there is one coming up from above on the left side uh now i mean i have to make sure that i'm staying away from that uh and now i'm going to hide behind here and then these two will come near me and then i will uh defeat them so now you can see like there is one more down here and it has an umber parasite with it so i have to take that umber parasite out in order to give him damage so just let's take that out and and uh, uh, now, now we can give him damage. That's that's why I was saying you like try to locate uh, these. Um, if you can find them up, you can easily defeat these ones uh just make sure that you uh you scan them once you are into the arena uh if you find them just take them out just don't waste more time uh, looking for them otherwise uh as i told you like you would um be running out of time at the end and then you will have to uh i mean <laughs> meet the disastrous end <laughs> which is he the boss would take you out uh in one shot and you won't do anything to it now i have to take out the amber parasite yep there it goes i think there are two more uh so this is the one and the other one is over there 
So let's say there's someone also uh, giving me damage from behind. So I think there are three, not two. So just let's take take the Umber Parasite out. Okay, so I'm going to defeat this one first quickly. And then we are going to take care of the last one here. So I think, oh my goodness, that, yeah. Okay, so this is the last one, I think. No? Still have, yeah. So we have defeated the boss. That's it. Well, that's how you defeat the boss. It's very easy, as you can see. Uh, you can do it easily with these lumpy hammers if you have. I have enhanced lumpy hammers, which should give uh, more damage. So just make sure that you use it uh, and defeat the boss easily. Well, that's it for the video. I hope you like it. If you do, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to watch more lots of foreign related videos. Thank you for watching and have a very nice day. I must will and prevent my rightful return.